Hello everybody, today I will be teaching you how to set up and use Joinly messages. It is a plugin that I created for versions 1.13 to 1.18. It supports a wide variety of languages including Norwegian, Chinese, French, and Spanish. To get started, click download now. Once the file is downloaded, head over to your plugins folder and upload the file. Once the file is uploaded, Head over to your console and start the server. I hate to interrupt today's video, but today's video is sponsored by Pyrohost.cloud. Get started hosting your Minecraft server, website, or Discord bot starting as low as $1 a month. Their amazing support team will also help you if you want a custom plan to fit your needs exactly. Make sure to check them out by clicking the link in the description or by heading to Pyrohost.cloud. Thank you for sponsoring today's video. Anyway, let's go ahead and get right back into it. Once your server is online, simply go ahead and run slash jl config and that will bring up the GUI to configure everything about this plugin. On this GUI you can find multiple things. To get started, simply click this arrow and as you can see, here are all the different languages this plugin is translated to into, including Spanish, Norwegian, and Chinese. The first main thing to configure on this plugin is the join title. To do that, simply go ahead and click the name tag. And as you can see, here's the prompt for this uh, title when you join. So that's the top big bold title when you first join. And then we'll get to the subtitle here in a second. To set it, simply run slash JLMST. And I'm going to do um, be welcome and F player name exclamation mark. And as you can see, it's now been set. And let's go ahead and configure the join subtitle now. To configure the join subtitle, simply go ahead and click the lever. And it's the same kind of setup, so go ahead and run JLMSBT. And I'm gonna do B player count people or uh, people are watching exclamation mark. And as you can see, that's now been set. And now let's go ahead and configure the join sound. To configure the join sound, click the note block, then click on this website, and you can find a whole list of Minecraft Java Edition sounds, and once you find a sound you would like to use, simply run JLMSS, and um, I'll use block, note, block, and fling, just like that. And once you set it, you should hear the sound you selected as soon as you run the command but my audio is off, so I did not hear it. Let's go ahead and configure the next thing. The next thing to configure is the join message. To configure that, click the beacon, then run slash JLM, JM, and whatever you want it to be. So I'm gonna do B or, uh, I'll go ahead and do welcome, and then uh, B and player name. And as you can see, that's now been set, exclamation mark. And let's go back into the GUI and configure the leave message. Now, let's configure the leave message. To do that, click the lava bucket. And as you can see, it's the same prompt. Simply run JLM, LM, and the goodbye, and then comma, uh, B player name, and F exclamation mark and as you can see that's now been set and if you go back into the configuration GUI we have two more things left to do the plugin status and reload the plugin the last two things on this plugin are the configure plugin status button which allows you to turn on and off the plugin depending on if you want it or not and if you go back you can reload the plugin if you configure it in the config.yml reload it using this but if you're just using the commands in game, you do not need to reload the plugin manually. If you click on the stick, just to let you know, I don't remember if I told you already, but if you click the stick, it'll give you all the help guides you need, including our Discord, our documentation, and the tutorial you are watching currently. Real quick, to test it, simply go ahead and join your server, and as you can see, it says welcome someone's son, one people are watching, you can always change that. I just assume that there's going to be more than one person on your server. And as you can see, it says, welcome someone's son. 
and it played the sound effect, but my audio is muted, so you didn't get to hear it. If you enjoyed today's tutorial, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below saying what plugin I should do a tutorial on next, and I'll see you next time. I can't wait to leave.